Did you know that tiny particles inside atoms have been around since the Big Bang, nearly 14 billion years ago? But not all atoms are stable. A super strong nuclear force holds protons and neutrons together in the nucleus. If the force is strong enough, the atom stays stable. But if there are too many protons or neutrons, things get shaky and the atom becomes unstable. So what happens? It tries to fix itself by getting rid of extra particles in a process called radioactive decay. There are three main types of decay. Alpha decay, the atom loses two protons and two neutrons, forming a brand new element. Beta minus decay, a neutron turns into a proton, and a tiny, speedy electron, a beta particle, is ejected. The atom moves up the periodic table. Beta plus decay, a proton transforms into a neutron, releasing a positron, like an electron but positive. The atom shifts down the periodic table. So how do scientists know if an atom is stable? They use an NZ graph, which plots the number of protons and neutrons. If an atom is off the stability line, it's likely to decay.